Capture fisheries support the livelihoods of over 120 million people. Small-scale fisheries produce two-thirds of all catches, destined for direct human consumption, and provide 90% of the employment in the sector. Small-scale fisheries provide directly or indirectly uh, livelihoods to a large number of people, including in terms of employment, in terms of income, in terms of food security. It is important that uh, small-scale fisheries are sustainable and effective for the fishers, fish workers and the fishing communities. Important challenges that small-scale fishing communities are facing include declining fish stocks, competition from other sectors which are more powerful and the overall marginalization of small-scale fisheries. These guidelines are the global consensus on principles, on best practices and on guidance to ensure that our small-scale fisheries are sustainable. They look beyond fisheries, they look out of the box because they also address issues like gender, social development, employment, decent work, uh, disaster risk, climate change, issues which do have an impact on the daily life of small-scale fishing communities. So government, ministries, policies, they need now to start working on the implementation of the guidelines. The figures we currently have about small-scale fisheries are based on estimates. So it is important that uh, policies uh, seek uh, to improve uh, the availability of uh, data and uh, information. The sustainable development goals include a specific target in relation to access of small-scale or artisanal fishers to resources and markets. So the implementation of these small-scale fisheries guidelines are really one way to achieve these objectives. I can see we're making progress. We need to keep the momentum. That is important.